Each year, the 18th of September is observed as World Water Monitoring Day. Across the world, activities and outreach programs are held to build public awareness to the importance of protecting water resources. Today on Water Wednesdays, we want to share how the BWA protects our precious water on island and how many quality checks are done before it reaches your taps. Your water has three levels of protection. The first one is at the source, the production wells of the BWA. Since 1963, the groundwater supply of Barbados has been legally protected with the Barbados Groundwater Protection Policy, better known as the Zoning Policy. This policy divided the island into five water protection zones, one to five, and protects the BWA supply wells against bacteriological contamination and the pollution. Zone 1 has the highest level of protection. All of the BWA wells are located in Zone 1 and this policy prohibits particular activities, for example, animal husbandry and the construction of residential developments in these areas. The second level of protection is disinfection using chlorine. Chlorine is either injected into the production wells or just before the water enters the distribution system. The chlorine inactivates or destroys any disease-causing microorganisms that may have passed protection level 1. Although injected at the well source, the disinfecting power of chlorine remains in the water until the last house on the distribution system from that well source. The third level of protection now uses a three-pronged spear similar to a trident. This tripartite arrangement involves the water quality personnel of the BWA, the environmental health officers of the Ministry of Health and Wellness, and the officials of the Environmental Protection Department. Every month, officials of the EPD and BWA collect water samples from all public supply wells, springs and desalination plants for testing at the Government Analytical Services Laboratory. The BWA requests tests for primary contaminants and bacteria established in the Drinking Water Guidelines by the World Health Organization. Weekly, the water quality officers of the BWA collect water samples from 50 different points along the distribution system to ensure chlorine has reached all of the districts in the island. Different sample points are chosen the following week and concurrently, environmental health officers at each of Barbados' polyclinics also conduct routine water sampling and testing for chlorine residuals and bacteria. Both BWA and Environmental Health weekly water samples are tested at the Best Dos Santos Public Health Laboratory. So what can the public do to protect our water quality? Well, you can be the eyes of the BWA for starters. You can properly dispose of all waste. Place household waste in garbage cans or skips for collection by the Sanitation Service Authority. Remember. Littering contaminates your water, so refrain from dumping. Report all burst mains and remember, the sewage system is not an alternative dumping ground. Next time on Water Wednesdays, we'll continue with some easy things you can do to protect drinking water sources. But that's it for this episode. To view this or previous episode again, please visit our website www. BarbadosWaterAuthority.com. You can go to our Facebook or Instagram pages for additional information or just subscribe to our Water Wednesdays channel on YouTube. You can find us there.